Okay, we're here at Carverdale, or not Carverdale, we're here at Marion Airport, and I'm going to taxi to the active runway, and then uh, take off just to show you around on the graphics on uh, X-Plane Simulator, and show you how much better it is than uh, Flight Sim. X-Plane's main goal for development was to create a uh, really smooth running simulator, so um, right now I'm getting uh, 40 frame rates per second, you probably can't see that in the corner there. But this is my setup. Those are my rudder pedals down there. And this is my yoke. So I'm just taxiing back to the active runway now. And we will take off here in a few minutes. pick up a little bit of speed and of course we have the beverage of choice on this airline today we'll probably cut a little bit short we don't need the whole runway today so we'll take off from this intersection here okay we'll cut the throttle and you do steer with your feet on the ground, not with the yoke. Slow it down a little bit. Okay, now I'm going to turn right onto this other runway here. I think this is runway one at Marion. And we'll do a short little flight to Carbondale just to test this uh, camcorder on my iPhone uh, 3G. I'm using two monitors as you can see, got a really wide view. Okay. We won't use any flaps and we'll go ahead and apply full power. See if we can take off here. Get out to 890 knots and pull back. And this plane has a lot of power. We're climbing at about 3,500 feet per minute now. Gear up, flaps all up. Left turn towards Carbondale, heading towards the west. A little bit of rudder pedal. Uh, to your left too as you're turning. Don't want to turn it too steep. And we're at 2,000 feet, so we'll cut back the throttle a little bit. Level it out. There's Crab Orchard Lake to your left. A little bit of down trim. And looking for Carbonate Airport. I don't have it in sight yet. We're going over uh, energy now, I think it is. Cut the throttle back a little bit more. We're at 2,600 feet. Don't know how long this camcorder is going to last, but you can really see the graphics of the lake there, the cloud reflection on the lake. Uh, the water effects are really awesome. And I think I just barely see Carbondale Airport there to the right. I can see the light from the runway. I think it's uh, runway 2-2 uh, two, two that we're landing on. I'm not quite sure. Or maybe, I think it's 1-9 actually. So we'll get lined up for that. Cut the throttle back a little bit more. Make sure we maintain 2,500 feet. There's Carbondale to your left, all the trees. Okay, we just got a little bit of turbulence there. Going 167 knots at 2,400 feet. Okay, I see the runway and I'm a little bit high. Cut the throttle back a little bit more. 
and we'll lose a little bit of altitude. Okay, gear down to slow us down a little bit. Throttle idle. Barely see the runway, they're all line up to it. The Vassy saying we're a little bit high, two white lights. Once we slow down here a little bit more, I'll put some flaps down, readjust the trim. 10 degrees of flaps down. 130 knots. Okay, we're coming in at about a 45 degree angle here, so I still have to turn a final. And we need a little bit of power. Still a little bit high. We'll be crossing uh, Route 51 here any minute. I can see it ahead. Okay, I'm going to level off a little bit. I'm going to put down 20 degrees of flaps now. That's the maximum this plane has. Okay, 80 knots. Increase the throttle a little bit. You can see the uh, shadow from the cloud there. 79 knots. 78 knots. Need a little bit more throttle. A little bit more trim. advise usually pilots have two hands so they're not worried about holding a camcorder and route 51 is coming up right there you can barely see it there's the runway I'm gonna be landing on take a left turn in final now a little bit more power Okay, now yeah, we're perfectly lined up. Again, we're just about to cross 51. You should be able to see it there. This is usually where uh, air traffic controllers would be giving them uh, clearance to land about right now, but I don't feel like dealing with air traffic control tower. Need a little bit more throttle. Flaps puts a lot of drag on your airplane. And it just told us we're 500 feet above the ground. We're a little bit high. I always like to be a little bit high though, just for safety reasons. A little less throttle. Cut the throttle once over the runway. Okay, flare, stall. Okay, a little bit of back pressure, slight brakes. Let's get at the tires a little bit by accident. We'll take a left right here so we get off the runway. Okay, and that's it. We safely landed at Carbondale from Marion. Hope you enjoyed.